Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for March 17th of 2024 is titled NGC 7714, Starburst After Galaxy Collision. So what do we see here? Well, here we see the image of a galaxy or actually more than one galaxy together. And what we are seeing is the interaction between galaxies. And that's why they look so distorted and unusual compared what to, to what we usually see. Now, we often see galaxies as spiral structures, and we see that in our own Milky Way, as well as other external galaxies. Now, there are other types of galaxies as well. Spiral galaxies are just one of the prominent ones because of their beautiful, majestic spiral arms and are often photographed. Now we see when they do interact, they become distorted and that's their gravitational fields interacting and distorting the material within them, pulling streams of material out into different directions. So we can see some of that here where a galaxy likely passed right through the center of this galaxy. And when that happens, stars pass right by one another. The spacing between stars is so tremendous that the stars will rarely to ever if ever collide. And what we do see is that the gas clouds will collide and that will enhance star formation, giving us a lot of intense blue color here. Now, why is it blue? Well, when stars form, the first stars to form and the most massive and brightest ones are hot blue stars. So those highlight regions where the star formation occurred and we can see that here. And we can also see parts of the older uh, left behind galaxy in the reddish and yellowish color. Their light is dominated by older stars, stars like our sun that have evolved and become red giant stars. So in a very young galaxy in very recent star formation regions, they're going to look blue because those are the stars contributing most of the light. In a much older galaxy, it's going to look yellower uh, because the light is then dominated by the red giant stars. Now, what will eventually happen here? Well, this will settle back down to just being a single galaxy. This process that we're seeing at this stage took over a 100 million years to get there. Galaxy collisions are not instantaneous by any means. They take long periods of time to occur because of the great distances between the galaxies and the great sizes of galaxies themselves. But over another few hundred million years, it will likely settle back down just to being a single galaxy and eventually will look like nothing ever happened to it. Now, we know that's the case because other galaxies have undergone collisions in the past, including our own Milky Way. And after a billion years or so can look just like an ordinary galaxy again with almost all evidence of that collision erased. But this is how galaxies have grown over time. Galaxies in the very early history of the universe are known to be very small galaxies. And we see that through collisions and cannibalization of other galaxies, they grow to the much larger spiral and elliptical galaxies that we see today. So that was our picture of the day for March 17th of 2024. It was titled NGC 7714 Starburst After Galaxy Collision. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be a spiraling comet. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.